I had a vision of your blood, and it was glowing in the dark. You stood in the shadowy wing, and the heat in my chest imploded like fire-born nebula, an uncontrolled birth of galaxies, stars, stories. Gripped, the hair unbounded, the laughter rolled over on my belly. I have the sense you could magic me right out of myself with your cryptic laughs, sharp as uh uh, smooth like pahoy hoy. Yeah, this is an unlikely mystery. Laughing, rolling teardrops down that old river of woe. This chest pressed is rage and her mother's sorrow, so I wiled away my secrets, hiding them like grubs under stones, swallowing soil, listening to the slow pace of story, hovering seedlings waiting to breathe at the breast of my mother tucked under. Still, this breathlessness cannot contain the sway of hips or crossing of moon phases or tumbling of waves. So, tickle me instead. Tell me a joke. Why did that damn chicken cross the road, calling white eyed into night, domesticate in spite of it all? Is it so difficult to poke these old joints, or must we carry on with our heavy loves and creased stories? Sometimes it's the only light we've got in all this wild darkness, the light of story, the light of creation, your face peering, emerging, dancing, flame and fire song, your laughter raucous as crows, crazy as coyote, trickery and mischief, walking sideways right with all that talk story, dissolving in warmth, black gold smiling up at your indigenous heart. Still, it's the same old story. Could be war, could be terror, definitely darkness, definitely a warrior, could be hell or kings that fell. Country decimated, earth emaciated, story eradicated. But the stars, they glow anyway. So sing me your poems. We'll drum away our fears. Let's sing the sun right up. Let the wrinkled old story return. So I've loved you before, damn it. I'll love you again. I have no choice when my heart is my voice. And I had a vision of your blood. It was glowing in the dark. Aloha keakua.